hey guys welcome to my channel in this video i want to show you how to set up your tapo smart plug so here's my tapo smart plug right here okay so here's it right here so let's go ahead and set this up the first thing you want to do is to get your phone so here's my phone right here okay and the next thing we want to do is to download the Tapo app. So you want to go over to your app store, open it. If you're using an Android device, you want to go over to the Google Play Store. And now we need to type in Tapo, T-A-P-O, and tap search. So here's the app right here. In my case, I already have the app, so I just need to open it. If you don't have the app on your phone, you're going to see the download icon here. So you want to download it and follow the instructions to install the app on your phone. Okay, so let's open it. Okay, and now we need to log in or create a TP-Link ID. If you don't have a TP-Link ID, you want to tap create a TP-Link ID here and follow the instructions to create an account. In my case, I already have an account, so I just need to tap login. Okay, then I need to enter my information. Okay, now let's tap login. So we are in. And if you're signing up for the first time, make sure you allow the app to access your Bluetooth and your location. So make sure you go over here and turn on your Bluetooth. All right. Also, you want to go to your Wi-Fi settings and make sure you're connected to the 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi. So let's go back to the app. And now you need to tap the plus icon here. Tap this and tap add device. Okay, so here you need to select your device, so plugs. So make sure you select Tapo. You can see Casa here and Tapo here. So make sure you select Tapo. And I'll come over here and select plugs. Tap this. So now you want to select your smart plug model. So mine is Tapo P125M. You can find this on your pack. So here, okay. So here's it right here. You can find your smart plug model here. And you can also find this on the device itself. So right here. Okay, so here's it right here. You can also find the model here. So let's go ahead and set this up. Select your smart plug model. So mine is a Tapo 125M, that this. Okay, now we need to plug in the smart plug. So get your smart plug and plug it in. Okay, and once you plug it in, you want to check if the LED light is flashing blue and orange. If it's not flashing, you want to press and hold the power button here for about 10 seconds until it flashes blue and orange. So this flashes means the plug is in pairing mode. So let's go ahead and set it up. So go to the app and you want to tap already orange and blue, tap this. So wait a few seconds. Okay, found it. Now it's searching for your Wi-Fi network. So here, again, make sure you're connected to the 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi and tap your Wi-Fi. And now you want to enter your Wi-Fi password and tap next. Tap next again. So it's connecting. We need to wait a few seconds. Okay, so the setup is almost complete. And now you want to tap here and rename your device. Okay, and once you're done, tap next. Now select your location. In my case, I want to go for living room. Tap next. Select your icon. Tap next again. Okay, now you want to check the firmware. Okay, sounds good. Tap this. So that's it. The setup is complete. And now you can control your smart plug through the app. Turn off, turn on. Okay, so that's how it works. And you can also set your schedules. So tap here to open it. And you can see schedules here. So you want to tap here and tap the plus icon here. 
So set your time, set AM or PM. And now you want to come over here and select your days, okay? And once you're done, tap save here. So that's how to set schedules. And you can also set timers here. So type here and set it, okay? So that's how to set up your Tapo Smart Plug. And you can also get it connected to Alexa or Google Home. So tap here, you can see me, tap this. And you want to tap third party services right here. And now you can connect to Alexa, Google Assistant, Smart Things, and so on. So let's say we want to connect to Google Assistant. Tap Google Assistant. And you can see Tapo Actions, tap this. Now link from Google Home app. Make sure your Google Home app is set up. Tap this. So wait a few seconds. Okay, now you wanna tap agree and link. Okay, wait a few seconds again. Okay, it's linked. Okay, so it's connected. So we can now use the Google Assistant. Let's test it. Tap here. Turn off smart plug. Okay, turning off smart plug. Okay. Let's go again. Turn on smart plug. Sure, turning smart plug on. Okay, so that's how it works. That's how to set up your Tapo smart plug and also get it connected to Google Assistant. Okay, so that's it. That's how it works. I hope this video was helpful. And if so, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for more videos like this. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.